All right, hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome to Gunfire Reborn. It is a first-person shooter roguelike, which are few and far between, but not always that bad. Okay, mouse is not responding immediately. All right, shift to dash, everything is good. I like the low poly style with this, this is kind of neat. Okay, energy orb. Okay, so I've got... Ah, interesting. So they're using hero shooter mechanics here. I dig it. Cavalry, three shot burst, third shot auto crits on hit. 50% chance to cause an explosion that deals corrosion damage when killing an enemy. Oops, there we go. Tab to open to the backpack. Weapon and inscription. Each weapon has its own attribute, and inscription on the weapon brings more diverse enhancement to the weapon. Cool, normal ammo, large ammo, special ammo. Gotcha. Got it. I'm digging that crit. Okay, secondary skill, smoke grenade. I'm not actually sure how the smoke grenade works. All right, so we get a bunch of ammo. I don't have to worry about that. No, I do actually. Or no, that's the amount of clip. I got it. Alright, well I don't see anything else around here, so I guess I'm just gonna bail. Uh, looks like we got shield and health. This is neat. I'm digging this. What's the mission this time? Said that demonic ore has appeared at the Long Ling Tomb in Dragon's Peak. The chaos is spreading uncontrollably. What? It's nothing. That's all, I'll leave. I feel like the translation is gonna be rough. Take this jade pendant, it should be useful for you. Alright, so I'm just gonna be playing solo, at least for the time being. So we'll figure it we'll figure this out. So what are you watching? Gunfire Reborn. It's a first person shooter roguelike, and that's pretty cool. Need to activate arm support, so I feel like there's gotta be some level of uh meta progression here. Well that's fine. I honestly wish they could Okay, Cryos is working on the translation. Well that's kind of exciting. That'll probably help it a lot, actually. Alright, I'm going to turn the sound effects down further. I turned it down a lot. The music seemed to be kind of non-existent, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, but that's... Oh, did that... Did that... That actually go? It did. Alright, we're good. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of gun noises, to be totally honest with you. Like, whenever I'm playing a game, I kind of just prefer to hear the music, a little bit of the sound effects, and then, apart from that, just kind of... Not just like blam, blam, blam. It can be okay in certain games. There, there are definitely games that I've played in the past where it sounds like super nice. Oops. Hmm. It looks like I'm supposed to be able to go in here. Is it a secret? I don't really know. All right. Not sure if I'm supposed to like shoot these. I bet these are just for the procedural generation of the level. They have multiple different exit points, but they just close them with a door. I could be wrong. I'm looking forward to seeing what kind of goodies we can get as we go along. The idea of... The idea of randomly generated effects on top of, like, kind of a bunch of disparate guns is actually really exciting for me. Star Devourer plus one. Normal ammo cannot reload by hand, but reserve ammo's auto-reload when you stop shooting. Lightning damage deals shock effect. Extra accuracy, extra stability, 50% damage against enemies that are shocked. Cool. I'd, I'll take that. So I got a... I got a Thunder Zapper. I'm gonna keep shooting the pots. It seems like it's actually worthwhile. And yeah, no reloading. I just have to wait for my ammo to regen. Open the treasure chest. Treasure chest has... Golden Goblet. Overflowing with mysterious energy. Pick up to enhance power. Ascensions determine the direction of growth in this adventure. Level 3 ascensions have powerful additional effects. Reasonably match ascensions, occult scrolls, and weapons to help you go further. So, enemies affected by smoke grenades explode after dying. After using the smoke grenade, extra max HP and shield, or extra lightning damage. Obviously, electro damage. I'm using electro gun. Duh. End of the next stage. Well, that was quick. Hey, how's the pew-pew? 
just got started. Thank you for sending this, Karis. I... I... I will admit I had, uh... Whoops. That guy's just getting shields back. Whatever. He's kind of nothing. Let's just do that. Ow. Whoop. That's a grenade. Yeah, I'd requested this game on Key Mo Mailer, and then I got really distracted because of... Between, um... Between Maneater, uh, Monster Train, and, like, a billion other things this week, I just have had zero time to actually do whatever. Ooh. Offer life, gain money. How much do I hate myself? A lot. We just got started, maybe we'll be okay. Or I die horribly, and you know what? We just start over, and that's just the way it is. Why is there some HP here, I think? Nope, that's normal ammo. Uh-oh. Maybe that that was... Seriously, is this just normal ammo? It is! I suddenly have made terrible mistakes here. Well, I'll just make it work. I just have to not get killed in the next however long it takes me to get my health back. <laughs> yeah, there's like zero music here. All right, well, if there's zero music, I'm just going to turn it off entirely and I'm going to listen to my own. I'm sure there is music, but let's not do chill. Let's do chip tune. That's better, but I should probably turn it down a little bit. I love pretzel rocks. Uh, let's see. No, this is probably fine. I don't want to want it to be too loud. Alright, so what is this? Piercing flame, bolts pierce enemies, reload speed, weapon auto reloaded when unequipped. Cool. I think I'm gonna go with the thunder gun, just because that's what I've been using. And see what else we have. Oh! So by completing a uh by completing a achievements you get uh you actually get to unlock new weapon types. Okay. Ooh, this one's a sniper. Whoa, that's a, that's some sensitive business. Can't complain too much though. All right, aura of venom. Uh, let's see. Pick this up instead of the, the regular starting pistol. So I got a pit, uh, venom pistol. Got some other stuff. I'm not getting a whole lot of HP here. Let's see. What do we? Oh, hey. None of this is HP though, and another golden goblet. So. After casting Energy Orb, extra weapon damage in the next hit. Uh, I'm feeling Electro Dominance just because I have an Electro Gun. All the other ones are kind of probably also good. Oh. Can I not replace... I can't replace... I can't replace my starting gun. Really? Really? Yeah, it looks like you could only replace one or the other. Okay, tip. Multiple elements on one enemy. I'll see what I can do then. Okay, let's wait for this to come back a bit. Uh, there you are. Now, oh, I do have a smoke grenade. Well, I got him with the poison. It seems like it'll... It's good? Ow. Thought I was out of the range of that. Alright, can I, can I get rid of that? No. Oh, those are grenades. Wait, how do I... Oh, I've got three. The smoke grenade is not a cooldown thing. I actually just have a limited amount of it. I got it. Makes sense. The starter gun has infinite ammo. That makes sense. I guess I should probably use the starter gun. Uh, what are you? Vault. Need a special talent to explore. All right. Well, I can't get in there. So I gotta, I gotta be a little careful as I've taken a smidge of damage. What the devil? Okay, those things are a little spooky. They just kind of, they just. All right, cool. They're just bombers. They're kind of cute, honestly, compared to like the usual bomber types. Well, 
I don't know. Uh oh. Am I okay? I'm slightly poisoned. Okay, avoid that. I'm trying kind of hard to stay away from getting poisoned here. But I guess it doesn't pierce through shield, so I guess it's not so bad. Whoops. Alright, get rid of him. Give him the smoke grenade. No, smoke grenade actually does mess him up. Okay, we're good. Alright, so what are you? Wild hunt. Both pressing or releasing the fire button will trigger a shot. Uh, let's see, chance to fill a magazine. Eh, it's okay. I'm liking my electro gun, especially because... What are you? Oh, that's that's uh, special ammo of a variety. Avoid you. Drop that. Never mind. Didn't get give me any good. Hello? Enemy? Uh, craftsman. Okay, we're going to deal with him in a second. Give him the old poison grenade. I wonder if I can actually... Oh, hey. Boop. I wonder if the grenade is actually based on what weapon type you're using. No, it doesn't look like it. All right. I like this gun. It's very... Brrr. Might be a little risky, though. Hello, what are you? Uh, triple comeback. Max HP and shield will be cut in half, but you gain two extra rebirths. That's a terrible idea. And I'm going to turn the music up just a smidge, maybe. There we go. Okay, so what do you got? Can enhance weapons or reforge weapons Gemini inscriptions. So crit plus 40. Auto reloaded when unequipped. Loading a magazine reload speed. Eh, it's okay. Uh, let's enhance this. So that just makes it uh, plus 2. And I'm mostly just going to work on making this gun top tier. That's good. What are you... Oh, this is this is the other gun. Michelle's taking a cookie. We made butterscotch cookies the other day, and they are delicious, and I want more of them. But we're at... Ooh. That might, that might be something. When we get the ability to do... Like, have a little bit of verticality. Alright. Golden Goblet. Uh, let's see. Nah, let's go with this. 120% lightning damage, 50% lucky shot lucky shot chance against enemies and shock effects. I don't actually really know if my current weapon has much of uh, that, and this is just visual, nothing more. Alright, it's so onward. Almost onwards. Onwards. There we go. I wandered now. I want to bake. Baking is good stuff. I, I've been trying to... I've been trying to bake a little bit more often. It's difficult to do so, just because. Man, those guys are just... Yep. Uh, let's grab those. Uh, yeah, I'd like to start baking some more bread. I keep saying that. That's the thing. It's like, I want to I wanna bake more. But it is, it is difficult to do so. With, like, my schedule and time and stuff. And so I'll always be just a little... Okay, get rid of that. Get him stuck there. I'm gonna... I'm assuming there's bonus headshot damage. Horse head. Okay. Oh! So there's a secondary fire on this gun, which is effectively just... Pump shots into dude. Oh, that kind of works. I'll just give him the poison. Uh, doesn't look like I got a secondary fire on this one. Did that get him? The answer is no. What if I can freeze him in place? Okay. I guess that works. Curious if I can freeze him in place while he's got his shield 
shield then and actually use that as an opportunity to pelt him a little bit. Ow. Well, okay. There we go. Life is kind of good. Boop. Too bad. Nothing, nothing so far as death. Three shot burst. Extra damage against enemies in the decay effect. Auto reloaded when unequipped. Extra effective range and accuracy. Eh, it's okay. I mean, it's probably good. Don't get me wrong. But I'm kind of digging the weapons that I'm rolling with right now. Because we've got one regular ammo, one special ammo. And then everything else is good. Anything in here? No. Let me go check out this check out this upper area. It seems like there's something maybe here. Can hop out. Nope, that is that is just the endless gray void of nothing. Nothing there. Nope. Alright. My secret hunting will have to wait. Hello, you are a peddler. Hello, ped pedal man. Doesn't look like anything's coming after me, so what do we got? Uh let's see, that rec restores some HP, refills ammo, grenades. Frenzied Shark. Bouncing grenades cause small area explosion on hit. Projectile point two for every enemy killed. Resets after a reload. Extra lucky shot. Blech. Bullets lined up horizontally when fired. And knock enemies back on hit. It's okay. And fire damage does a burning effect. Uses large ammo. Uh, ooh. Bonus weapon damage against enemies that are shot. Okay, I have some amount of money. So let's go back to this. Okay, so now I've got fire gun. Doesn't look like I've got a uh, special effect necessarily. Like a, a right-click thing, like the poison thing had. Arcus. No, it doesn't look like it does any lightning. Hit him with that. Might as well conserve some of my ammo here. There's somebody up here. That's oh, a horse head. Was a horse head. Ow. You got at least a little bit of HP. Not prove my chops some of these hits, though. That's okay. I wonder if you can... Whoa! Hi! Gash! I'm not big on the enemies just kind of respawning after you clear out an area. Uh, might as well revive. Well, that didn't work. Uh, I'm not, I'm not big on enemies just kind of respawning behind you. I've never really liked that in games where it's just like, Hey, uh, well, you have entered the room, and now the enemies are just behind you. How did they get there? You may ask. Funny question, that, and then kind of nothing. Oops, insufficient grenade. Ow. Switch back to you, now that I'm out of, not out of juice. I got, I'd rather have all the enemies in, this, in, the, uh, in the room at the start. So that's always so much more, I'm gonna say predictable, obviously. But it just feels better. Maybe it's not so bad in this game. But from my perspective, it's always kind of wacky. That's a good hit. There it goes. Okay, there's one more guy lurking somewhere around here. Plus, who knows what else. It's something. Boop. There we go. The bullet bank. All ammo picked up will automatically convert. Ooh, yes. That's that's a good one. I right, got anything else? I don't really see so. Don't see much. And the answer is Golden Goblet. After casting an energy orb, shield recharge speed extra. Energy orb has more. Yeah, let's go for advanced shield. That seems that seems vaguely worth worth my time and so on and so forth. Alright, are we going? Okay, there we go. And looks like it's a boss time. Final stage. So, don't have too much money. I spent a fair bit of it. I'll just up that. Okay. 
Go back over here. Peddler sells cavalry, frenzied shark, and an Argus. So looks like the weapon variety is a little thinner. It's mostly just pick what you want. And boss fight. Well, at least he's cool looking. Okay, that does some horrible things. Ow. Okay, for him to try and die. So it looks like he's got his own shield, which is a bit messy. Hit him with that. That is, that is a tough shield to crack. Okay. Plunk him there with this for a second. Back to you. Nice part is these two guns reload. when I'm not using them. Gosh, that was squanderous, but that's fine. We got him. All right, the buggy, bug's dead, bugs are dead. So we get another Star Devourer. Let's compare. Uh, extra damage against enemies and shock effect, burn effect. Chance to recover 50% ammo when you kill an enemy, better luck chance. Yeah, that's pretty much just a straight upgrade. Whoops. Okay. Extra crit, first shot after reload, drop ammo for current weapon on crit, kills, extra damage against enemies in the burning effect. It's okay. I think I like mine better. Uh, let's see, what about you? Illusion. Firing increases rate of fire. Extra damage against burning, decay. Nah. And we get another golden goblet. So, extra damage against an enemy... Let's go with this one. Extra damage against enemies that are being affected by an elemental effect. Or remaining cooldown. Yeah, sure. That sounds kind of good. Who are these things? What are you? Why are you just there? Or is that part of the boss? Actually, no. Just looks like there's a bunch of weird mask bits all over the place. I wonder if you can actually get uh, health bits from these. Probably not. What else did I... What else did you do? Oh, no, these are just the two guns. Three guns? Right, three guns, because I didn't care for that one. All right, onwards and wherever. Hey! Ah. Uh, thank you, Ming, for the 15 bits. And Malcolm, how you doing? Uh, let's see. I'm getting a mortal redneck with Borderlands guns and furries vibe from this. Can't say that's bad at all. Yeah, it works. I, I feel like the character models are kind of almost meaningless, apart from... Okay, I, I, I dig. A, uh... A cute Doberman... Oh, nope, that's the Craftsman. A cute Doberman with a, uh... Wow, okay, that got him. Uh, we're taking some hurts, though. Okay. Yeah, a cute Doberman with, uh, with dreads. Not something I would have expected. Like, not, not something that I usually would say, like, oh man, that's really cute. Ow. But in that case, pretty cute. We're getting blasted. Those are kind of hard to avoid. Ow. Whoop. I'm dead. Uh, that's expensive. What even? Oh. I guess I hit an explosive barrel. I must have been standing on it. Well, that's fine. Uh, we did okay. So, we get some soul essence. Ah, here we go. Wake up. What happened? 
It's just the art of soul regeneration. Uh, remember the jade pendant I gave you some time ago. That jade pendant is able to connect your, uh, to your vitality, helping you refine and enhance your soul essence. Alright, Talon's important growth mechanism for heroes. Consuming soul essence allows you to permanently strengthen your abilities. Alright. So we've got... Break the glowing crack? Yes. Let's grab that. So extra shield, extra skill damage, extra HP, extra ammo capacity, uh, energy orb cooldown. And the rest of these I gotta hit level 10, and I am talent level 2. Oh, that makes sense. Well, I'll pick that up to start with. Carry more ammo. I'm feeling more shield. Because max and shield out seems like a good idea. Damage resistance, efficient casting. So a lot of these are mostly just metric stuff. So you won't die, providing aid to teammates. Huh. Discounts. Ooh. Purchase goods at lower prices. Just get free items from Peddler. Got it. Start the battles with some copper. Alright. Sure. I'm just gonna go with this. Uh, It'll be taken back to the end. Wait. What is this over here? Rainbow. Unlock at level 10. Well, I'm telling level 4. That's not bad. Yeah, here we go. So, Rainbow... Thunderclap loves. I'll buy. Ah, the other character. Deflection shield. And spirit feline. Alright, cool. Well, I'm just gonna hit confirm. Let's just go. Alright, so we've unlocked some new weapons. Blip. And Wanderbit. Wow, you can go up to four players with this one. Okay. That's... That's not a... Oh, need to activate arm support, so I don't have that. Well, what happens if I go this way? Nope, that's a dead end. Or, well, less dead end, doesn't matter. End of the next stage. But yeah, playing this four-player, I, I could actually see that being pretty fun. I might... I might see about that at some point. Okay, so we now have access to the vaults. Which hopefully get me something cool and or new and or useful. Alright, let's grab that. We've got the Wild Hunt. So it's a uh, super shoddy. A dig. I'm almost out of ammo for this gun. But that's not that big of a deal. Okay. Okay, so I've uncovered a vault. Dig it. I'm gonna run out of juice for this thing. That's the one fear. Yep. Juice has been emptied out. Oh, what do we get? So does this just mean more upgrades for me? Found accumulation. Every five shots, the next shot deals extra damage. Sure. Why not? It's not something that I'm going to rely on, but I'm sure I'll passively passively feel the, the effects of it without even noticing. That's usually how it goes with those. Okay, let's get out of here. So what do we... what do we got? It does look like ammo economy is going to be a bit of a letdown on this gun. We're going to be... burning out pretty bad. Constantly. I'm going to run around shooting these a bunch. At least I can, like, use my grenades in this game. I gotta train myself to do so. Normally I'm like, grenades are rare, can't use them that much. And in this game it's like, just shuck grenades! You're never going to... You're never going to use them. It's gotta be good on automatic guns. It's kind of what I was thinking. It's completely pointless with my, with my double shotty. Because currently... Whoops, that didn't work. Uh, if, if I'm not mistaken, the bonuses reset every single time you reload. And that... That sucks, but that's okay. Open treasure chest, and we get same thing. Uh, let's see, more fire damage, extra meters explosion for energy orb. Eh, let's go with that. I don't really know what kind of weapon type I'm, what weapon damage type I'm going to be using. So, like, what's the point of trying to go for that? It'd be neat if you could actually get a build where you can just chuck energy orb constantly. What is the cooldown on that? Looks like it's 20-30 seconds, give or take. My balls are gonna be huge. 
which means I should probably see a doctor. Hello, I'm Agro Man. I gotta be gone. You go for pots? I mean, it's worth it. Especially because I'm burning through ammo non-stop with my, my one gun. I'll probably switch it around, but still. Surprise! Whoops! Hello! It is, it is pretty chef's kiss. This, this gun has a lot of what I'm looking for whenever I'm using a, uh, a super shoddy, which is two shots and it just absolutely destroys things. And the reload speed isn't super freaking long. I always had that problem in uh, Warframe. I loved the Tigris. It was a super good gun, but I could never really get over the fact that the reload speed was a lot longer than I wanted it to be. I'm pretty sure there's dudes down below that just, like, bailed here. Yeah. Really do not like the respawning enemies thing. That is, that is going to bother me endlessly. A lot of it just has to do with the fact that, like, it's so hard for me to keep track of where enemies are when they keep spawning in like that. Because normally, like, when I'm going through a level... I'm kind of keeping a running tally of, like, enemies are probably over there. And so losing losing access to that because the enemies, uh, you know, just kind of spawning in wherever the heck they want. Ooh, cav cavalry. I like that. Uh, let's see. Cover smoke, wildfire. Killing an enemy affected by an elemental effect. Problem is I don't have any elemental effects. Oh, interesting. So you can actually see which ones you have, or could go for. I was hoping for more elemental orbs. Well, go for that. I don't really have much of an immediate use for it. That's okay. Uh, let's see. So this is the... Oh, you can actually switch this gun between auto and semi-auto. I'm not actually sure if that makes a difference. Maybe a slightly faster rate of fire? Hard to tell. Shotty fires once when you press and once when you release. Yep, just figured that out. I was not reading the tooltip. I I will admit, I like to... For better or worse, I tend to play everything by... Uh, by feel first. Which is probably a bad thing. Hi. But it's, it's one of those where uh, I'd rather pick up a gun, fire it for a little while, then figure out what it does. Which is probably bad. Alright. Or Venom, Piercing Flame. Bullets pierce enemies. That's eh, okay. I didn't like Scorching Flame as much. Or a Venom. Lucky shot chance. Chance to cause an explosion that deals corrosion damage when killing an en enemy. That might not be a bad idea. The... I'm gonna grab the Piercing Flame. I think, instead of the shoddy. Shoddy's a good... is a good gun. But I think I want the ability to... Oh, is this a sniper rifle? Right, this is a sniper rifle. We had one of these earlier. Well, quick, quick shotting. You know, this is actually going to work out probably better. A lot of the enemies don't work great at a range. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, let's revive. That was a bad thing to turn the corner to. Uh, oh, no, that's normal. Okay, Argus, bullets lined up horizontally. Let's try that. That should be fun. Okay. Into the vault. Uh, 
Okay. Maybe this thing... Bit of a mistake. I think sniping might work better for me. If I wasn't playing alone. Maybe it's not so bad. I don't know. I think I'll switch it back. Uh, let's see. Resolute. Extra movement speed and damage when your shield is zero. Ooh. Oh, shield didn't... Recharge interval just got doubled. Maybe that was a mistake. Oh, well. I mean, that's just going to be the name of this game here. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Let's see, how long have I been playing this for? 35 minutes. Let's go back here. Let's switch the piercing flame out for the cavalry. I think I need something a little bit more... Oh, nope, that's the... That's the craftsman. I think I need something a little bit more active. Just because I tend to go kind of aggro with my my builds. Ooh, another vault immediately. I could take it. Alright. A lot of those beetles are just popping down. I'd be curious if there's going to be something up there or not. Alright, what do we got? Uh, let's see, Elemental Rage, Backpack Expansion. Hmm. I'm not really doing any of these. Extra damage on the... Ooh, maybe that's not a bad idea. Let's increase the damage, just by a smidge. Alright, and let's go talk to this guy. Probably not worth my money. And normal ammo, normal ammo. Fortunately, all of these guns are... Yeah, no, let's let's save it. I bet we can get better better guns. Hi. Can I shoot these? No. Ah. There are... Certain points. Ow. That was worth it. Uh, let's see. Reduce dash cooldown. Well, that... You know what? That makes perfect sense for that. Alright. Do you got anything else around here? The answer is no. Uh... Wait, what? Okay. Chuck some grenades. Pop this. Gets me nothing. Yeah, so the poison grenade ain't a bad idea. Ooh, Star Devour. I, I will dig. I enjoyed it previously. Ooh, that poison, poison damage is good. Okay, get rid of the force man. Demolish this man. Wow, okay, this longbowman is a little tougher than I was hoping for. All right, there we go, challenge event. A risk that may appear at any time in the adventure, but it also means unexpected goods. Good. Enemy explodes after being defeated. Well, that's something I can work with. This is probably deadly. Well. Ah, oh, I was really hoping that would actually... I hope... I was hoping that would actually mean that, uh... That's the good stuff. Uh, I was hoping that would actually mean that they would, uh, hurt each other, too. Maybe it does, and it's just a very limited... AoE. Could be wrong. Okay. Avoid him for a second. Life is good. Don't have to worry about the explosions too much. Not yet. Oh, gosh, there's a lot of enemies up in this. 
Ah, ah, that worked badly. Okay, we are near death. Probably just gonna take it in this case if I go down. This is rough. I'm not actually... He must have shot me. Yeah, let's give up. I obviously don't have much of a choice either way. Alright, so this requires... Oh. Dang, I was hoping I could get more energy orb. Cool down that way. Alright, whatever. Uh, probably more shield? More shield. Skill damage would be nice, but survivability is better. That is... I need some more points. I need a lot more points than this. Help. We get some new new bits at least. 